Hi everyone, Jewel Mayberry here and today we are talking about house rulers and how to find those and what those are. And a house ruler is the same thing as a house lord. So when someone talks about, you know, the lord of a certain house or the ruler of a certain house is placed a certain way, that is what we're talking about. So I'm going to show you how to find that and um, it's really easy. So we have a Aries rising birth chart here. So that means Aries is here on the first house. And as we go through, we end up with Pisces on the 12th house. So every planet rules a sign. And there are three signs that are ruled by two planets. Um, so Aries is ruled by Mars, Taurus, Venus, Gemini, Mercury, Cancer, the Moon, Leo, the Sun, Virgo, Mercury, Libra, Venus, Scorpio is ruled by both Pluto and Mars, Sagittarius is ruled by Jupiter, Capricorn is ruled by Saturn, Aquarius is ruled by both Uranus and Saturn and Pisces is ruled by Neptune and Jupiter. So the reason that some signs are ruled by two planets is because in traditional astrology, the only the planets through Saturn were known. So as um, humanity has you know developed better means to peer into the night sky, we have discovered the outer planets, Uranus, Neptune, and Pluto. And so those planets have a personality, and so they were assigned a, a, a sign. So every house is ruled by a sign, and every sign is ruled by a planet. So Where's my eraser? Here it is. So, the Lord of Gemini, the Lord of the third house in this birth chart, is Mercury. The Lord, the ruler of the ninth house, is Jupiter in this birth chart, because this is an Aries rising birth chart. The rulers of Aquarius are Saturn and Uranus. So now, let's erase the planets here, and we are going to put the planets in different places and talk about where the rulers are located of these signs. So, let's, for instance, let's put the sun in Aries. We'll put Mercury in Pisces. And we'll put the moon here in Taurus. And we'll put Venus with the sun. We'll put Saturn in Capricorn and we'll put Jupiter over here. Yeah, we'll put, you know what, let's not. Let's put Uranus over here and Scorpio. So let's work with those. So we want to find where the ruler of the fifth house is. So, the sun rules Leo. So the ruler of the fifth house is in Aries, in the first house, conjunct Venus. Where is the ruler of the seventh house? Well, the seventh house in this chart is ruled by Libra. So we're going to find Venus, because Venus rules Libra, and it is in the first house with the sun. Where is the ruler of 
the 11th house. Do you see it? Take a minute. So the ruler is Uranus and Saturn. So where are those? Uranus is here in the 8th house in Scorpio. Saturn is here in the 10th house in Capricorn. So we want to find where is the ruler of Taurus? Where is the ruler of the second house? Well, Taurus is ruled by Venus. Venus is here in the first house with the sun, which is also the ruler of the fifth house. So we have the second house ruler and the fifth house ruler conjunct in Aries in the first house. And that is how we find house lords and house rulers. It's very simple. Um, so please subscribe to my channel and I will be putting out more new fun videos. And I'm glad to see you again. And I hope that I get to see you again super soon. And find me on Facebook and at Truth in Aspect Astrology on the Internet. And I'll see you soon, soon, soon. Bye-bye.